stormy day. It's a beautiful day for the mountains. Great day for a drive. My friend SJ invited me to join her at a hot spring nearby. Seems like a good idea. Hopefully you guys want to come along. Well, this is an unfortunate reality of van life, road life, if you will. Well, the good news is I've got a van to cook some food in and I have AAA. So probably could be worse. Yeah, so here I am. Enjoying my impossible meatball sandwich. Waiting for the tow truck. Or we'll figure out if it's the battery or the alternator, but I'm pretty certain it's one of the two. Two nice uh, local ladies just stopped. Thought I should mention that. Been here a while. Nobody's really stopped to check on me. But these two nice local ladies did. And again, lucky I have AAA. So there's that. At least I got that going for me, which is nice. Well, AAA just called and they don't have anybody big enough to tow me right now. <laughs> so my saga continues. Stay tuned. Well, I'm pretty sure that solves it. It looks like it's the alternator. The uh, solar panel, the photovoltaic system, it'll charge the batteries. Once the coach batteries are full, it'll trickle charge to the start battery in the van. So, I let it sit for a while, turned all the systems off, it charged the battery enough to start the motor and then within a few minutes the light came back on again so yeah it's only after i go uh shopping fill up with water make sure i'm plenty stocked that's that's when shit hits the fan but it's, that's life you know Here I am still. I figure it's like at least an off chance that it might be a bad cell battery. The battery could be at its end. It's at least worth trying is what I told AAA. Um, if I'm sitting here waiting for a tow truck in the first place, might as well give that a shot. I mean, it doesn't hurt. I am a premier member. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let me speak to your manager. Anyway, I let SJ know. And, uh, man, it's just a double bummer. I was really looking to, looking forward to hanging out with my friend SJ. But, um, I don't know. <laughs> that ain't gonna happen. <laughs> Some more nice locals just stopped by, and uh, <laughs> worst comes to worst, they told me I'd be all right staying here for the night uh, off to the side of the road. Yeah. <laughs> I'm very thankful for the generosity. Just uh, wasn't hoping it'd come to that. <laughs> But it's nice to know. And they're good people. It's good good talking. Uh, they got a van like this one, so they know. Things happen. The funny thing is about uh, alternators, well, batteries for that matter, is they don't give you any warning. Uh, they, just, they just go out, like I was saying earlier, because my system's tied together with the photovoltaic power, and that feeds the start battery. Uh, 
gives me just a little bit of hope that it would be the simpler of the two fixes and just a bad cell battery. But, um, yeah, fingers crossed. Hopefully AAA comes out here at some point, tests the battery, and at least puts my mind to ease at that one. So that wouldn't be a bad thing. Um, thanks for following along. The saga continues yet again. Well, 11.30 at night. I've been here eight hours. It's time for a glass of wine. One glass of wine. If I had any more, maybe somebody would show up, but then there's no guarantee I'm getting anywhere safely. Either way, glass of wine, time for bed. But, uh, you know, I don't want to sound snarky because I'm just, I'm just brutally honest. I'm, I bet you one of my friends shows up before AAA. There's a good chance, whatever the problem is, we have it fixed before I see or hear from AAA. Good night.